यस सर थैंक यू सो मच नमस्ते विथ माई सिंसियर प्रेयर्स टू ऑल माई टी एंड इज बेसिंग टू वन एंड ऑल विद यू परमिशन फ्रॉम अवर प्रेसिडेंट ऑफ द सेशन टूडे प्रोफेसर एच एस गुप्ता सर मे आई स्टार्ट द सेशन सर प्लीज थैंक यू सर थैंक यू सो मच Uh, in fact, uh, morning uh, has been already done. Done. Recently, Professor Arbi Singh uh, expired, so therefore we should mourn his death this time in this episode. Uh, let us stand up and keep silence for two minutes. Sane, Professor Sane Lata, Professor Sane Lata, a better option. May I request Devan? आरबी सिंह साहब बली सिंह प्रोफेसर लता प्रसाद प्रोफेसर आरती सिंह वी हैव लॉस्ट आई एम ऑलरेडी हियर सर गुड इवनिंग सर प्लीज प्लीज मॉर्निंग वी वांट टू मोर डिटेल्स ऑफ द प्रोफेसर जगतकर सुवर just recently expired after 39th episode so please thank you sir dear friend uh, before we are start the official functioning camera to please of this uh, uh, 40th uh, episode we have some Yes, sir. Not a photo. Hello. That some of our. Sir, some of the team for the rest of the world is coming to us. And contact to here and call link for friends to join. This time. Some link is on the line. Now, just click on it, na. So, open it and then join the option. Join, join, join the side right side. Me. Link to click on it. Now, open it. मैंने वो विंडो खोली विंडो में ज्वाइन कर जगह आप सब दिखा दे ज्वाइन पर क्लिक करें ज्वाइन हो जाएगा क्लिक करें बंद करें फिर से क्लिक करें ओके बिकॉज ही वॉज सफरिंग ऑफ ए सीवियर डिजीज दैट इज कैंसर एंड ही अस्योर्ड अस दैट आई सुन एज आई गेट रिड ऑफ दिस डिजीज आई विल बी very much happy to deliver lecture and write chapter on professor kn singh but unfortunately professor rb singh is no more with us and we have to choose some alternative person for dr kn singh professor kn singh another very senior professor of geography of patna university who was also the principal of the prestigious college that is patna college patna she has also left us a few days earlier and one very shocking news we have got that uh, husband of professor uh, s nagia has also left the world professor nagia has been very much associated with us from very beginning of our uh, our uh, this uh, uh, lecture series and we have received much blessings from her side i uh, 3 days earlier 4 days earlier i was with him with her on on uh, her residence in uh, um, gurugram haryana 
and I try to share our uh, feelings with us. So we have to mourn the death of these three dignitaries. One, Professor R. B. Singh of Banaras Hindu University. Number two, Professor Sanjay Lata Prasad of Patna University. And number three, the husband of our uh, very much beloved Jorafar, singer Jorafar, Professor Sudesh Nangia. So, uh, with the permission of the chair, I request all the dignitaries who are here on the screen to uh, stand up for a, for a minute and pray God for the peace, providing peace for this very significant departed great noble soul. Thank you, sir. We should now stand up and have a mourn for a minute. Om, Om Shanti. Now, now we should take our seat and it is up to the chair, chairperson and convener to, uh, to start the proceedings of the today's session. Om Shanti, Om Shanti, Om Shanti. Thank you, sir. I now request Dr. Harsimrat Kaur, Madam, Assistant Professor, Department of Geography, Ranji Women's College, Jharkhand, to propose welcome address to the gathering. Good evening, everyone. Thank you, ma'am. With extreme privilege and gratitude, I welcome you all in the 40th episode of the online lecture series on founders and makers of modern geography in India, initiated by Institute of for Environmental Research and Rural Development, Patna, Bihar. Today, we all are gathered here to remember our profound geographer, Professor Pradyuman Bande, former professor and head, Department of Geography, Ranji University, Jharkhand. Really, he was person of the wise virtues and blessed with a golden heart, contributed excellent work in the respective discipline. In the galaxy of geographers, I am recording James Hutton, who propounded the theory of uniformitarianism and said, that the present is the key to past. I can relate that theory with the concept of this lecture series as it unveils the contribution, rigorous hard work and personality traits of eminent scholars who left for heavenly abode and their golden legacy has been shared by their close associates who also shine with embraced grace and intellect inherited from them. With this, I heartily welcome the person with a like charm and scholarly epitome, well-known eminent scholar with reputed contribution in the field of geography. Yes, I'm talking about respected Professor H.S. Gupta, president of present lecture series, former professor and head of school studies in geography, 
पंडित रवि शंकर शुक्ला यूनिवर्सिटी रायपुर छत्तीसगढ़ Your gracious presence is a felt aura around now. Thanks for being the part of today's occasion, Gupta sir. The person who effortlessly and restlessly contributing his day and night to illuminate the path for future scholars in the light of recent geographers' contribution, a guiding pillar, an eminent scholar, a humble and truly down-to-earth soul, Professor Devendra P. Singh. Director Researches Institute for Environmental Research and Rural Development Patna Bihar former vice president of Nagi who is the great strength of this lecture series thank you devendra sir for gracing this occasion with a vision to develop geography with a vision to contribute some more every day the ever tiring enthusiastic scholarly personality convener of present lecture series professor s v chavan former professor and head department of geography university of mumbai maharashtra ex president of the bombay geographical association we heartily welcome you respected ma'am now yes, i sir. welcome our esteemed chief guest a very dynamic intellectual personality yes. professor a krishna kumar kal ka the of geography registrar at shri krishna devaraya university anantapur mein kamal kya kehta hai She contributed excellent research work that published in reputed journals and books. अगर ओके फिर से हम लिंक देते हैं ऊपर ठीक करो। Best Teacher Award for the year 2018 at Amrita. ना कुछ मोबाइल आपको अपडेट मांगा थी यार। मोबाइल अपडेट मांगा थी आपको। अब आइए तो सांके देखा हूँ। Google Shastra Bhushan Award. मोबाइल अपडेट मांगा थी आपको और आके देखा हूँ। At BHU Varanasi in February 2023. Thank you so much, ma'am. for being with us i'm pleased to welcome renowned distinguished guest professor kalpana markande former professor and head of the department of geography and geoinformatics osmania university hyderabad telangana and also an active national fellow at icssr her contribution in the field of geography is really remarkable it's a privilege to have you with us welcome kalpana ma'am It is my pleasure to welcome a very gentle and humble person with ever-reaching approach to all needful. He is an eminent scholar and relentlessly contributing to the field of geography. Yes, I am talking about our esteemed speaker of today's episode, Professor Chitendra Shukla, former professor and head of the Department of Geography, Dean in Social Sciences, Nilamal Pitambar University, Dalton Ganj, Jharkhand. We heartily welcome you, Jitendra sir. Wow! Today, the whole Bharat is Bhogoli Goshti. Me, mano, a samikrit sa lag raha hai. Kya uttar hai, kya dakshin, kya purab hai, aur kya pashchim. Now, I welcome our esteemed dignitaries, our prestigious guest of honor, Professor Bindu M. Bhat, head department of geography, the MS University of Baroda, Vadodara, Gujarat. Eminent Professor Anuradha Sharma, Head Department of Geography, University of Jammu, Jammu and Kashmir. Well-known intellectual Professor Madhu Shri Das, former Head Department of Geography, former Dean in Faculty of Sciences, Guwahati University, Assam. Esteemed scholar and blessed with a beautiful melodious voice. Yes, that is Dr. Kaveri Dabhatkar, ma'am, Assistant Professor, Department of Geography. Government Bilasa Girls PG Autonomous College, Bidaspur, Chhattisgarh. Their contribution in the field of geography is highly acknowledged. They all are the pillars who are adding strength to our subject geography. From bottom of my heart, I welcome our all esteemed guest of honor. Warm welcome to our esteemed guest from beloved neighbor country, Professor Safter Ali Shirazi. Professor and Director, Institute of Geography, University of the Punjab, Lahore, Pakistan, Vice President of Pakistan Geographical Association. Now I welcome my generous and respected colleague, Mrs. Uh, Ms. Shalini Pushpa Karketa, Associate Professor, Department of Geography, Ranchi Women's College, Jharkhand. She is going to propose a vote of thanks. Who put their tireless efforts? With technical support in organizing the whole set of series, is Dr. Amrish Kumar Rai, Assistant Professor, 
पीजी डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ जोग्राफी वीर कुंवर सिंह यूनिवर्सिटी आरा बिहार एंड डॉक्टर अमित कुमार असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर एंड हेड ऑफ पी जी डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ जोग्राफी मुंगेर यूनिवर्सिटी बिहार वेलकम एंड थैंक्स सर फॉर बींग देर विद अस this lecture series is really a milestone in itself as through this we learned about the integrity heavenly virtues trustworthy and deterministic behavioral traits and contribution of our eminent scholars professors disciples and gem souls of discipline the geography this platform resounds the journey of eminent intellectuals with personal and professional details that no doubt motivates us but also inspired us to contribute constructive and productive research work in the field of geography i feel extremely glad to welcome esteemed dignitaries this galaxy of geographers from all over the india and abroad from core of my heart for gracing this occasion with your auspicious presence highly obliged and warm welcome once again thank you Thank you so much, Doctor Arsimrat Kaur. What a heart-touching welcome address! Thanks a lot. With due permission of our president of the session today, Doctor H S Gupta Sir, I would like to briefly introduce today's mm -hmm. president and distinguished guest of the platform. May I, sir? Ah uh, yes, why not? <laughs> thank you. Thank you so much. I am also indeed blessed to be on this platform. of founders and makers of modern geographers in india and thank from the core of my heart professor devendra pratap singh sir for associating us to this galaxy of geographers today we have with us professor h s gupta sir as president of the episode on founders and makers of modern geography in india professor h s gupta born on 7 july 1942 has an excellent academic record after passing the high school and intermediate examinations from uttar pradesh board he did his ba from university of allahabad and ma standing first in order of merit and phd from banaras hindu university varanasi sir joined the school of studies in geography pandit ravi shankar shukla university raipur in 1966 and served there till his retirement in 2004 in the capacities of lecturer reader and professor during his tenure as professor in the university sir was head of the school of studies in geography for 11 years till his retirement in 2004 chairman board of studies in geography for 13 years dean faculty of social science for one term and director in charge institute of management for 4 years he was formerly president institute of indian geographers for two terms and member private universities regulatory commission government of chatisgarh sir is the founder patron of chatisgarh bhugol parishad professor gupta has published more than 40 research papers the first being some dimensions of regional planning in reputed indian and international journals and edited books three textbooks and one research monograph he completed two funded and four departmentally initiated research projects and was associated as deputy director with an indo us research project sir has successfully guided 18 phd and more than 60 mphil students sir has taught regional development and planning as a paper at postgraduate level for nearly 3 decades of course the sir's contribution is enormous but here sir has provided very with very brief cv because of the main session that will be going on thank you sir thank you so much for accepting our invitation to preside the session we are also honored to have chief guest of our session today professor a krishna kumari professor and head department of geography she completed her msc and phil phd in geography during 1987 to 1993 from sk university anandpur madam joined university services in february 1989 as assistant professor 
and got promoted to associate professor and elevated to professor in 2006. She has to her credit 55 research papers, published and attended 30 seminars by presenting papers, edited two books as seminar and conference proceedings, translated five volumes of intermediate geography, Andhra Pradesh State Open Schools. She has written and edited seven books for Telugu Academy for Intermediate and Degree in Geography. In the field of research, she has successfully guided 11 PhD scholars and six are presently working for their doctoral work. Three MPhil scholars are awarded degree under her supervision. Madam has completed two research projects of UJC. Professor A. Krishnakumari Madam also organized successfully three national and one international seminar sponsored by UJC, BST, BOE, ICSSR, and ISPO. Organized one workshop in association with Andhra Pradesh Space Application Center. Madam has helped the administration of the university in several portfolios as BOS chairperson, deputy warden of Women's Hostel, member of Revaluation Committee, coordinator for cultural activities, Director in charge for Women's Studies Center, Coordinator for NSS Sale, Registrar at SK University. Presently, Madam is Dean at Research and Development SK University, Dean Faculty of Life Sciences and Principal SK University College. She has been on foreign visits to Sri Lanka, Malaysia and Singapore for academic assignments. Madam has been awarded with Andhra Pradesh State Best Teacher Award for the year 2018, UGIT Excellency Award in 2018 at Peradeniya, Sri Lanka, Mughal Shastra Bhushan Award by Deccan Geographical Society India at Banaras Hindu Vara University, Varanasi in February 2023. Other assignments to her credit are as member and subject expert in various state and central academic groups. Madam, thank you so much for associating with us on this platform today as chief guest of the session. We also have distinguished guest, Professor Kalpana Markande, Madam, former professor and head of Department of Geography and Geoinformatics, Usmania University, Hyderabad. Dr. Kalpanna Markande Madam is National Fellow ICSSR from January 2019. She has served Usmana University, Hyderabad, India for 37 years and retired as Professor of Geography in 2016. She has been Head of the Department of Geography, Chairperson Board of Studies, Coordinator for Center for Advanced Study in Geography, besides serving on several advisory bodies in Usmania University and other universities. She has a number of awards and a number of value addition tasks to her credit. MST Geoinformatics course was started in the Department of Geography, Usmana University during her tenure as chairperson. As coordinator of Center for Advanced Study in Geography, she set up a high-end special information technology lab at Department of Geography, Usmana University in 2016. She has published 26 books and about 60 research papers besides bringing out about 17 technical bulletins and four book reviews. She also gave 36 lectures for the educational multimedia country. White classroom of University Grants Commission, New Delhi, as subject expert, which were telecasted on national media, Doordarshan 1. Madam also developed e-content and learning objects depository for geography and geoinformatics respectively. Madam has successfully completed 13 research projects and has been a resource person for several institutions. Madam has organized 13 conferences and workshops, both national and international, and has attended about 70 national and international conferences and seminars. She's a member of several professional bodies. Thank you, Madam. Thank you so much for being with us today. And I was also associated with her in one of the conferences organized by her. We are also happy to have with us today our speaker of the session. One second, 
professor jitendra shukla sir sir has passed his ba ma phd from ranchi university he has been professor and former head department of geography nilambar pitambar university daltonganj dean faculty of social science presently working as professor of geography department of geography in ranchi university dr jitendra shukla sir is a well known geographer of the country and he is associated with various academic bodies at the national and state levels he is the vice president of the association of geographers bihar and jharkhand an executive member of the nagi practicing geographers iig and isdr and member of several academic associations sir has specialized in geomorphology regional planning and cartography professor jitendra shukla is a professor and former head department of geography npu medini nagar palamu and professor of ranchi university his major field of interest is geomorphology especially fluvial dynamics river health environmental geomorphology and regional development and planning sir's research outcome has been published in the form of more than 80 research papers in different nationally and internationally reputed journals and book chapters he is sole author of four books particularly geomorphology research methodology in geographical research regional planning and development an integrated approach to regional development and urban geography sir has successfully supervised 16 phd and 12 mphil research scholars three scholars have submitted phd thesis and eight scholars are working under his supervision at present he has completed one minor and one major project he has presented more than 150 research papers at national and international conferences and chaired several technical sessions of the various seminars professor <laughs> shukla has been professor and head department of geography and is now working as dean of the faculty of social science sir we are pleased to have you as speaker of the day today and i request you to please take the session on professor pradyuman pandey sir thank you thank you so much good morning good uh, good evening to all present in the present uh, seminar uh, ongoing seminar particularly respected uh, president sir uh, professor dr h s sharma uh, gupta sir professor <coughs> convener of this uh, session professor s v chaman madam chief guest professor a krishna kumari distinguished uh, guest professor kalpana markande madam and guest of honor professor bindu m bhat professor anuradha sharma professor madhu sri dash and dr kaveri dhavak davadkar and all the personality present in this seminar i feel really very honored to address the august learned gatherings of, of the galaxy of high profile geographers and geo scientists at this 14th 48th episodes of founders of founders and makers of modern geography in india on 38th july 2023 i am very much thankful and grateful to the organizing organizing body in suit of environmental research and rural development patna bihar for providing me, me such platform to bring out hidden and also an extinct treasure to inspire the पीलर ऑफ जोग्राफी टू हूम आई मेट 
in the 90s we composed a sir dr kalpana markande who to whom i met her 20 years ago when i was holding the seminar as chairperson and chairing the session on 11th asian urbanization international seminar at hyderabad कंट्री एंड पर्सनैलिटी ऑफ द रिप्यूट प्रोफेसर डॉक्टर प्रद्युमन पांडे वाज पॉपुलरली नोन एज पी पांडे ही वाज ए मैन ऑफ प्लेजेंट एंड चार्मिंग पर्सनालिटी ही वाज ए स्वीट टॉन्ग जेंटलमैन हैविंग ए हैंडसम एंड अट्रैक्टिव फिजिकल लुक ही वाज सच ए नोबल एंड हम्बल जेंटिल एंड वेन वॉलेंट ही हैड बीन ऑलवेज रेडी टू हेल्प एनी वन हो एवर सिक it from him whenever a person arrived at his door for any kind of help he never disappointed him or her whoever may he or she be he was such a person that nobody can claim that he could not help or support him or or, <coughs> or her after seeking it from him he was always ready to help a student teacher colleagues or even who ever may be he was a friend philosopher and guide for his student as an ncc officer he helped many students to further their careers as a teacher he was very successful and commanding respect and regard of all his students as a scholar he was a man of wisdom deep knowledge and high degree of intellectual sense as an administrator he was highly disciplined strict punctual abhi aaya pass pe aapka dena hai par pass pe dena professor pande was lai diya pura born in a farmer family of atmal bala police station of bath dona se kya hoga dona se koi kaise milega in india jitna hoga utna hi denge hum 1939 he was brought up in rural in the rural do aur manage kare maine aapke samne kar diya kahan se manage karte uske dost usko nahi de rahe the din dost ke sath rehti hai of his own village and secondary level education from usna hoga hum utna hi lenge hum advance thode de denge kisi ko was which was nearer to his village he passed matriculation examination from patna in 1946 very high marks for intermediate and bachelor level education he joined the famous patna college then known as oxford of the east he passed intermediate in 1948 and ba with geography honors in 1950 it is a net it is not worthy not worthy fact that when professor pande was a student of third year in ba honors geography of patna college during 1948 dr inayat ahmed one of the touring geography of his time joined patna college patna as a lecturer and dr pande came in a close contact to him and the closeness remained till the last breath of professor pande professor pande passed his ma examination of geography of from, from patna university patna in 1952 and got the first class he was rare day during those days after passing the summer master examinations he joined sbhe school move of patna district firstly worked there between 1952 and 1954 professor pande joined ranchi college ranchi as a lecturer in 1954 he old the post of the flight lieutenant in ncc 57 opportunity to work with professor inayat ahmed 
and their relation again was deepened. Professor Pandey was fortunate enough to work with the stalwart and his favorite teacher, Professor Dr. Enai. Of Professor Ahmad after about 13 years of teaching and research experience under the supervision of Professor Inayat Ahmad, Professor Pandey proceeded for London School of Economics for his doctoral research in 1965. The famous London School of Economics and for London in 1965 for his doctoral research. As he was selected for that course, there he was admitted in the PhD course under the supervision of a great geographer, Professor Emery Tung, who was professor of geography in London School of Economics and Political Science of London University in London. In 1965. This topic of doctoral research was impact of industrialization on urban group, a case study of Chutnaku. He completed his research within the given time of two years and degree of PhD was awarded to him in 1970. After that, he returned to his original post of lecture in Ranchi University, Ranchi in 1967. After the successful completion of his doctoral research, Professor Pandey returned to his original place in 1976. He was promoted to post of reader and become the head of the university, which was the most Regarded as one of the two, three best colleges of the of then state of Bihar. On March 23rd of 1976, he was posted to the RSP College Jharia of the Dhanbad district as principal, but he continued there on the on that post till the July 3rd of 1977. After that, he returned to his original position of the headship. Dr. Pandey was promoted to the post of professorship in 1978. That promotion was made on the basis of the recommendation of, the, uh, of his name of the post of professorship by the Bihar Public Service Commission. He took charge as the head of the department. Of geography of Ranchi University, Ranchi, for the first time in the month of September, nine for a days, in, uh, as Professor Inayat Ahmed, the, the, the then head of the Department of Geography of Ranchi University, Ranchi, was appointed as the Vice Chancellor of Magadh University, Bodhgaya. Professor Ahmed joined the post of VC of Magadh University, Bodhgaya, but he resigned the post within second after joining as it has. He was transferred and was asked to go to the Bihar University Mujafatpur. As he was transferred just after his joining the Magad University Bodh Gaya. The fall game test and hurt the sentiment of Professor Ahmad and he resigned from the post and the, of the Vice Chancellorship and returned to his original position of, of original position in Ranchi University, Ranchi. Finally, he, the Professor Pandey, became the head of the de uh, Department of Geography of Ranchi University, Ranchi, on August of the 1st of 1983, after the supervision of Professor E. Ahmad, and worked as the head till his untimely death on 5-5-1986. Professor Pandey breathed his last only at the age of 55 on April 5th of 1986, leaving behind his uh, him, his wife, three sons and two daughters. All of his siblings are now highly educated, and all of them are posted in higher ranks, both in government and private sectors. And uh, an early demise of his, of such a talented promotion and signing geographer was a great 
ruled, ruled the geography fraternity because he was a well known scholar all over the country and also had global recognition professor pandey was an expert of urban geography his own phd dissertation itself was devoted to urban geography his seven out of 16 published research papers were also related to urban geography he was guided one of his doctoral research scholars in the field of urban geography though the first he guided on several topics like the industrial geography and regional planning and geomorphology also there are 16 research papers published in different journals in his name those can be listed but the eminent the first mayurakshi river valley projects was published by the in the journal of patna university bihar in 1956 he was gone through a detailed analysis of the project in his research paper the second research paper named urbanization in bihar was published in 1963 in the journal of ranchi college ranchi another research article named trends of urban growth in chotnapur was published in 1966 in the souvenir of aligarh muslim university <laughs> 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 his research paper named the history of urbanization in chotna chotnapur duty during the 19th century was published in 1968 in the journal of historical research department of history of ranchi university is another research paper entitled regional distributional pattern of urban centers chotnapur was published in 1968 in the geographical outlook published by the department of geography ranchi university ranchi his another uh, uh, research article uh, uh, published in uh, published as urban hierarchy in chotnapur it is also in igu symposium uh, number uh, 15 of bhu varanasi his research paper entitled industrial landscape of greater ranchi Or... was an imminent imminent research uh, 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 paper uh, was published in 1969 in the geographical landscape of the high, uh, as geographical landscape of the highlands of chotnapur in this in the geographical outlook an article named urban field of uh, ranchi it was it is also published in geographical outlook volume 8 uh, published by the ranchi university ranchi urbanization in chotnapur in hindi Uh, was the paper presented by professor pandey in the symposium in patna university in 1970 the extent and level of urbanization was assessed and analyzed by professor pandey in this article in in the chotnagpur plateau the geography of green revolution in india was also a research paper authored by him as published in geographical output outlook volume 11 1975 another research paper some aspect of quantification in geography uh, published in geographical outlook 1975 uh, 76 uh, the mechanics of coal mining uh, subsidence a study in quantitative geography published in 76 77 in the volume 12 of geographical outlook likewise geographical personality personality natural resources and problems and prospect of economic development in india terra incognita the andaman and nicobar group of islands was published in 1976 outlook a safety measures of coal mining subsidence a study in quantitative geography some aspect of cultural life of those nagpur co authored by bp singh was published in geographical outlook volume 13 1976 77 78 another research paper landscape pattern in the environs of ranchi city some empirical evidence uh, to von thunen's model a model of professor pandey who authored by a uram was published in 1978 in the geographical outlook he authored two books the impact of industrialization on urban growth it was published by central book depot ilahabad chotnagpur region of bihar 
at that time was emerging as the industrial hub uh, industrial hub in the country many large scale industries were uh, emerging which promoted the urbanization of the region as a result many big urban centers were developing such as bokaro dhanbad ramgarh jamshedpur and several other small urban centers also sprang up and developed in the region and that boom becomes a bone for the uh, uh, later research research scholars this book of professor pandey becomes milestone for planning and development of the new growing centers in this region particularly for the jharkhand state modern and his another book was the modern geographical trends edited edited book was the second book published by today's and tomorrow's printers and publishers new delhi his edited book was a facilitation volume in honor of uh, professor e ahmed this book was published in two volumes consisting of 45 articles related with the different branches of geography such as approach and methodology geomorphology pedology environment and ecology geography and resources geography and resource utilization regionalization planning historical geography urban geography land use rural geography agricultural land and settlement medical geography articles related to the different branch of geography were written by scholars from the different countries of the world such as usa scotland nigeria adelaide melbourne tanzania netherlands paris tasmania and other countries of the world such all such papers were incorporated in his book in this book. many sir, geographers from different sir. countries of our country were also contributed their papers in this volume hello yes sir two star sir your slides are not moving oh, we are on the first slide mukra sir can it you speak moving. in english and hindi mix language it is moving now mix language sir in now now it is moving no 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 moving sir just wait sir isko dobara kijiye ho jayega sir now it's moving but it has gone to last slide yeah now first slide can you speak in hindi english mix language sir i will try my best ji 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 sir thank you sir don't uh, uh, ask like that <laughs> let the speaker deliver his lecture in which ever media he prefers Uh, very good i will try my best to have a speak in hindi also uh, uh, professor pande uh, uh, has written two books unka do pustak jo hai um, prakashit tha pehla jo tha uh, impact of Indus, industrialization on urban growth and yah pustak jo hai vishesh uh, kar jharkhand mein shodharthiyon ke liye aur vishesh uh, kar uh, yahan ke shikshakon ke liye मील का पत्थर साबित हुआ और यह एक जो है आधारभूत पुस्तक बनी जिससे आज तक विद्यार्थी और सुधार्थी जो है इस क्षेत्र में आज लाभान्वित हो रहे हैं इनकी दूसरी जो पुस्तक थी वो जो है एडिटेड जो है पुस्तक थी मॉडर्न जोग्राफिकल ट्रेंड्स और यह पुस्तक जो है एडिटेड पुस्तक थी जिसमें भूगोल के सभी शाखाओं को सम्मिलित किया गया था यह दो वॉल्यूम में प्रकाशित हुई थी पुस्तक और यह पुस्तक भी आज यहाँ के शुद्धार्थियों और शिक्षकों के लिए मील का पत्थर साबित हुआ है और दिस इज ए वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट बुक्स एंड आई थिंक इट हैज ऑल्सो बिन डिस्ट्रीब्यूटेड इन अदर लाइब्रेरी ऑफ द डिफरेंट यूनिवर्सिटीज ऑफ द कंट्रीज सो दिस वॉज एन इम्पोर्टेंट बुक्स 
टू ए स्टार्स ऑफ दी कंटेम्पररी ज्योग्राफी अंडर ही अंडर हिम अंडर हिज सुपरविजन कंप्लीटेड डिलीट डिलीट देवेर द फर्स्ट वाज द प्रोफेसर एम प्रसाद महेश्वरी प्रसाद इन 1977 वाज अवार्डेड डिलीट डिग्री अंडर हिज नोबल सुपरविजन लेटर ऑन डॉक्टर लेटर ऑन डॉक्टर प्रसाद बिकेम प्रोफेसर एंड हेड ऑफ द डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ ज्योग्राफी ऑफ रांची यूनिवर्सिटी रांची दूसरा सेकेंड डॉक्टर आर गोंतिया रिसीव डिलीट डिग्री अंडर हिज नोबल सुपरविजन डॉक्टर गोंतिया ऑल्सो बिकम प्रोफेसर एंड हेड ऑफ द डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ ज्योग्राफी पटना यूनिवर्सिटी ही इज अलाइव टूडे एंड ही इज द स्कॉलर ऑफ द इंटरनेशनल रिप्यूट टू लाइक वाइज डॉक्टर एजाज इमाम इन नाइनटीन एटी डॉक्टर अजय कृष्ण राकेश नारायण वेर वॉज ऑल्सो अवार्डेड पी एच डी अंडर हिज नोबल सुपरविजन so he was the man of the such personality who has held the all the teachers of the uh, universities of the uh, universities of jharkhand uh, today's they, today there are 14 or 13 universities in jharkhand private and government universities and most of the teachers was the student ha uh, mai bhi unka jo hai uh, 1982 में उनका एक विद्यार्थी हूँ जब 1982 में uh, 81, 82 में मैं मास्टर के लिए एडमिशन ले रहा था तो मेरा रोल नंबर प्रथम था तो उन्होंने यह इंस्पायर किया कि आप जिस प्रकार प्रथम रोल नंबर प्राप्त कर रहे हैं उसी तरह विश्वविद्यालय में आपको प्रथम में प्रथम स्थान प्राप्त करना है और उनका कहा हुआ यह आशीर्वाद मुझे लगा और मैं विश्वविद्यालय में प्रथम स्थान प्राप्त किया था तो प्रोफेसर पांडे वाज सच ए वाज ए सच ए पर्सनालिटी सच एन पर्सनालिटी हु हैज गिवन एन हेल्प द रिसर्च स्कॉलर्स स्टूडेंट्स एंड आल्सो द टीचर्स ऑफ द यूनिवर्सिटी एट हिज लेवल एंड व्हेनेवर ए पर्सन टीचर स्टूडेंट टू डालेंगे पानी एनी टाइप ऑफ पर्सन अराइव हिम टू एनी टाइप ऑफ हेल्प the other the it is the financial or the, the the academic help he has helped them most of the teachers have have been appointed uh, in in his uh, in his uh, uh, in his uh, chairmanship in the board uh, so that the teachers and students are indebted and grateful to him this was uh, this uh, this is uh, the Uh, this is this is nothing and this is nothing ab more about him it is a very simple and to say something more it is only lighting a lamp before the sun he has done in this region so he has great he has done a great for geography for this region for particularly ji jharkhand as well as the whole country and the international community too thank you this is about the dr pande thank you sir thank you so much professor jitendra shomar so sir for meticulously compiling and presenting great contribution of professor pratimam pande sir to his students institution society and the nation in the subject of geography thank you so much with due permission of the chairperson professor h s gupta sir i would now like to invite our guest of honors professor bindu bhat madam professor and head department of geography ms university baroda vadodara from gujarat to say a few words on this occasion for 2 to 3 minutes madam bindu bhat please thank you very much madam after a very long time i am again with you all uh, it's really a blessing you know to be with you all of course of such a great 
honor you know uh, today actually i got to know about respected pandey sir and his immense yep. contribution to the discipline and this is for the first time you know i have actually come in direct contact with pandey sir through the lecture and i, I am sure you know his contribution will always be mentioned in golden letters to the discipline of geography uh, i am really you know quite happy to know about such rich contribution by sir because i belong to the western part and i have joined re very recently only in 1997 so we are little away from this tall words also i want to mention that you know the blessings i can receive from all the great geographers who are been constantly uh, without tiring they are contributing and they are present for this particular program and really thankful to the team adivendra pratap singh sir and his team jalalam Mm. Yeah. Of patience and their non-tiring effort has actually made us mm. aware about such great personalities we probably have not met also, and now we are able to mm. know about their contributions. Mm. This is Come. something which I always mm. am in depth. Uh, Devendra Pratap Singh sir and others. Okay. I would definitely want to mention. all the senior geographers here this is something you know which was required that we get to know about our seniors this is that platform uh, we are getting a lot of information about our seniors so i i am thankful to all of you uh, inviting me for this program and i do attend this program frequently because i want to know about my seniors and their contribution in the field of geography thank you very much again thank you for the opportunity thank you thank you so much dr bindu bhat madam very rightly said by you it's really a great treasure that will be given to all our next generation geographers due to the efforts of professor pandes devendra pratap singh sir now i would like to invite professor anuradha sharma madam professor in the department of geography university of jammu jammu and kashmir to say a few words madam anuradha please thank you so much ma'am thank you so much for the uh, opportunity which has been extended to me uh, initially i would also like to personally uh, give um uh parties to heartful tribute to the uh, three uh, people who were associated to be with the job to whom we have given our uh, obituary in the uh, initial stage of this uh, uh, lecture uh, and then i would like to extend the uh, my uh, thanks from the bottom of my heart to the chairperson who has given me the opportunity and the organizers as well as the uh, prof uh, professor uh, devender sir who has uh, given uh, who has who has actually provided the platform to be with uh, all the eminent geographers all over from india and abroad as well so this is a great great platform and uh, uh, having her, uh, us all here is sir uh, all your effort and uh, your input that has always come uh, in different shapes in different uh, uh, perspectives that uh, has always come to us uh, very like he said uh, by uh, my uh, uh, very revered uh, geographer professor bindu ji 
that it is actually not only an opportunity to interact with each other, but also to understand the contribution, the great contributions that have been made by the drawings of geographers from different parts of the country and uh, how they have initiated in the pre-independent era uh, to, to understand from the geographical point of view uh, the different perspectives, whether it is from the uh, environment point of view, or it is from the urban point of view, or everything which was contributing to the context of geography, making geography more rich, making geography more wide, and more uh, understandable, and making people to know what the geographers are actually trying on. And here, in this case, uh, 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 Professor uh, uh, Pradyuman Panteji, who uh, has uh, 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 who had started giving his input in uh, urban geography and industrial geography, would have, which would have been uh, at a very uh, formative stages at that point of time. But now uh, they have uh, uh, these uh, uh, disciplines in geography. They have made greater strides. And uh, a lot of literature has been uh, uh, come forward from the different from the different parts of the country to make the Indian geography much more rich and uh, uh, much more, you know, understandable from different perspectives. So this is truly an opportunity for us to know about our seniors, uh, senior geographers who have put in so much of an effort and. Uh, 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 they have tried to explore the uh, new dimensions in geography, and uh, uh, that is why we are uh, we are here today in a position to uh, give whatever little we can uh, in the form of research, in the form of content uh, creations in geography, uh, uh, which which are of course a duty and parcel parcel of part and parcel of the uh, uh, the teachings and research that we are doing. So knowing about uh, a, a very senior professor who, uh, who has uh, given our subject so much, who was a man of heart and head. And uh, uh, at a young age, we left uh, uh, and still uh, contributed so much to uh, our field of geography. But, uh, uh, yes, these stalwarts and these drawings of geography, they have uh, actually um, given us the lamps to be carried on and uh, to do more with more interest, with more, uh, uh, you know, latest contributions that we can make in the field of geography. Uh, sir, thank you very much once again for uh, giving me this opportunity of uh, 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 listening to these uh, 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 interactions, uh, being a part of this platform. Thank you very much for giving me this opportunity. Thank you so thank much, you. Professor Anuradha Malam. So well said on this occasion. Thanks a lot. I would thank now you. like to invite Professor Madhushri Das. Professor and former head Department of Geography and former Dean Faculty of Science, Gavati University, Assam. Madam, Am I audible now? Yes, please. Madam, you're audible. Thank you so much. Respected President, Professor H.S. Gupta, sir. Key person behind the entire program, Professor Devendra Prasad Singh, sir. The convener of the program, Professor S.B. Chauhan, sir, Professor A. Uh, Krishna Kumari, ma'am, the chief guest of the session, distinguished guest, Kalpana Malkande, ma'am, the distinguished speaker, Jitendra Sukla, sir, honorable guest of honor, Professor Bindu M. Bhatt, Professor Anuradha Sharma, Professor uh, Kaveri uh, Devatkar, madam. Uh, Madam Kaur for the beautiful welcome address, the organizing secretaries of the session, Dr. Kumar and Dr. Rai. I acknowledge with thanks the efforts of the founders and makers of modern geography in India, especially Professor 
Devendra Prasad Singh sir, for initiating the 40th episode of the online lecture program, which is devoted to Professor uh, Pradhuman Pandey, former professor and head of the Department of Geography of Rakshi University, which is instituted by the Institute of Environmental Research and Rural Development Partner. I have had attended a couple of such lectures and have come to understand how important it is for us to know our past, to know our roots, to know the domain of uh, Indian geographers. And this platform has provided opportunity to all of us to understand our past, to understand our heritage, to understand the geographers who have left their footprints. And I must thank all of uh, who are connected with this endeavor. And thank you so much for having me here today to speak a few words on this beautiful location celebrating the life of Pandey sir, about whom I learned so much today. A life celebrated indeed. He was a true leader and so progressive way back in 1965, uh, he went to London School of Economics to pursue his research in urban geography. And he was much ahead of his time. He left so young, but yet his contribution was immense from the uh, research papers, from the book that has been uh, shown to us just now. I have attended a couple of lectures and I have understood how important these programs are. And we in Gauhati University, we also had conducted a lecture program, the 25th episode of online lecture program. Uh, in the month of September 2022, and that was dedicated to three Dayan of again uh, geographer of Northeast India. That was Professor Ishvitas sir, Professor Vinodha Gortakur, and Professor M. Taher. That session was al also as beautiful as today's session is. So I must thank all the organizers behind such important program uh, mm -hmm. who who, uh, who are contributing immensely for making such program a success and for making uh, the people should know the geographers from within the country and from from, from outside the country also in, uh, in this beautiful program. So uh, I must thank once again the organizers for having me today and for, uh, for letting us know the contribution of Professor Pandey and other professors also, eminent professors also from across the country. Thank you so much, Professor Madhushri Das Madam, for your inputs. Thanks a lot. I would now like to invite Dr. Kaviri Dabadkar Madam, Faculty Department of Geography, Government mm -hmm. Vidasa Dasar College from Chattisri. Kaviri. Um, Thank you, Madam uh, Savitrita Madam. Thank you so much. Uh, it's my proud privilege to be a part of this uh, 14th episode of uh, online lecture series on more of uh, makers in uh, makers of the modern geography in Indian universities. So of all, I uh, pay my regards to all the present here on this uh, uh, episode, Professor, uh, my guru. Dr. H. S. Gupta sir, uh, Professor uh, Savit Smita madam, um, my beloved uh, Dr. Krishna Kumari madam, uh, Professor Bindu Bhatti madam, Professor Anuradha Sharma madam, and all the respected uh, dignitaries who are present in, the, in this episode. Indeed, it's a great pleasure for me to express my views and share the views uh, in this uh, galaxy of professors. And uh, it's a uh, my my I I, I tribute my first of all I tribute my uh, heartfelt tribute to Dr. Uh, Professor P. Pandey sir for his contribution to the urban geography, which is precious for us. The way he explained the urban geography, urbanization, urban hierarchy that expand the reasons to learn the urban geography at all. I remember one share here, Akela chala tha zani be manzil magal, log milte gaye karwa banda gaya. Ji haan, 
indeed it's a hard work of a man who bring all the geographers in one platform that is uh, he is none other than dr dp singh sir his contribution his work his he is doing lots of work and this is the result of his work that we all are here since last two years and know the actual geography in the universities and actual actual work of our indian geographers we all know about uh, charles dickens and uh, may and coins and all and they are here and with foreign author and all that but what our teacher our geographers our indian universities geographers what have done it's really it's really untouched by us and professor and his entire team in the a great bhagirath yagya professor singh for his vision to shape the modern indian geography and illustrate the makers of the modern indian geography that ultimately which is a precious part of want to know the geography and geographers in india and now his new venture saga is another feeder really through which we know the scenario the personality of geography in south asian countries also so i again thankful to dr dp singh for his great really my i expect my regards to professor dr madam bhupendra madam adhyaksha sir for giving me this opportunity to express my feelings thank you very much Namaste. thank you so much kaveri madam you are always very charming and smiling and the points which you have put up here definitely uh, though the sessions are going on for last two years the efforts behind this by professor devendra pratap singh goes back to 20 years and that has given rise to the birth of another uh, good uh, platform of saga south asian geographers association where professor siraj sir professor umesh kumar mandal sir and many others from bangladesh sri lanka have made it a great success and would be meeting very soon thank you so much kaveri madam thank you siraj sir umesh mandal sir for joining and associating and helping us to move forward now i would like to invite our distinguished guests professor kalpana markande madam former professor and head department of geography and geoinformatics usmane university hyderabad madam please thank you professor chawan sabasmita chawan uh, professor hs gupta professor chawan professor krishna kumari and the speaker of the day professor jitendra shukla not to be forgotten and all the guests of honor professor bindu bhat anuradha sharma professor madhushri das and dr kaveri dhavadkar and also harsimrat kaur uh, i i do not have much to say you know most of the speakers have said everything but then uh, you know this has become a forum and it has become a place where we get together and get to know about the distinguished esteemed illustrious and also inspiring personalities in geography who have uh, inspired generations to come and who have made a mark for themselves not only for themselves they have made a mark for the subject of geography on the wider canvas of academics now as uh, expressed by professor <laughs> shukla <laughs> <and> <laughs> professor uh, pande was a distinguished personality uh, who was a kind of uh, enlightening personality i would say and his studies to get to the ladki aapki pe kagra ko kagra ki sabka to kachhe wale ke sath aati hai 
ਕਿ ਪਾਸ ਰੱਖ ਦੇਣੀ ਨਾ ਉਹਦੇ ਉਠਾਏ ਕੇ ਬਾਅਦ ਜਿਹੜਾ ਉਹਦੇ ਬਾਅਦ ਉਹਨੂੰ ਕੋਈ ਨਹੀਂ ਹੋਣਾ ਹੈ
Devendra P. Singh, Research Institute for Environmental Research and Rural Development, since the beginning of this series of lectures, which are going to be academically valuable and motivating. I am proud to be a geographer and very much delighted for being a part of this program. My sincere thanks to each and everyone who are toiling a lot in organizing this kind of knowledge enhancement program. I have to, I'm very much elated for involving more women geographers in this session. And for this, I'm specially thanking Professor Devendra Prasad Singh Ji, sir. One and all, and Thank you for giving me this wonderful opportunity, listening to you all. Thank you. Thank you so much, Krishna Kumari Madhu, for your presence and few words. And the question is, I don't know what I'm going to do. Sure, sure, certainly. With permission from H.S. Gupta, sir, we have eminent geographers on the platform. Can we invite a uh, few of them to say a few words? Yes, after that, Sam, go outgoing. As in, I will request, request, request to man one uh, request is here. Hello. Yes, sir. No, no, no. Doctor, 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 doctor Arun Shinha. He was. He is the student of Professor Pandey. And he has been retired from uh, Anthropological Survey of India. And he has joined this uh, seminar in this session. He is here. And I will request him to say, some few, some, uh, to say a few words uh, regarding Dr. Pandey. So, uh, Dr. Arun sir is here. Do you have permission from the chairperson? Yes. 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 Are you listening? I am audible. Yes. 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 हाँ तो कोई भी राज्य आप तो अब इस समय तो जॉग्राफी राज्य कॉलेज इन द ईयर 1965 व्हेन ही वाज हेड ऑफ द डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ जॉग्राफी राज्य कॉलेज मुझे क्या चाहिए तो बट इन द सेकंड ईयर ऑफ माय ऑनर्स इन द ईयर 1966 ही लेफ्ट पलंग एंड इन द ईयर ही लेफ्ट एंड वेरी इम्पोर्टेंट टॉपिक इन Professor Pandey was very kind to me, always, I don't know why. Whenever I have approached him for any help, he very readily helped me. One episode I would like to share with you. It's not a special to anyone. But I couldn't appear in my practical examination of D1 examination. Of degree one, there was a university. Uh, because the internal examiner didn't allow me to do it because I was late. I was appearing for my IMA examination at Patna. So I hurriedly went there. By the time the examiner was there, but internal examiner didn't allow me. So I got a brace in my practical examination. But I was promoted to D2. Then I went to Professor Pandey and told him, Sir, I want to study geography honors, but this is my result. If possible, kindly allow me. So seeing my theory paper, he was very happy and he allowed me to join the honors course. So I can say that today what I am, I am is mainly due to Professor Pandey. Uh -huh. He was known to me as a Pandeji. Whenever I have went to his house, always offered me sweets and cha and tea. And when I pass out, that time he was not in the department, he was doing his PhD work. 
under Professor Jones. Unfortunately or fortunately, you can say my teacher, Professor Tateshi Chakroti, also worked under Professor Jones on the land use pattern of Kidna. I think uh, most of you may be knowing Professor Tateshi Chakroti. He was the founder of the Department of Geography, but one university. Later, he joined the Planning Commission of uh, West Bengal government. Then moved to she as a senior professor to Indian Institute of Management, Kolkata, and he no, retired. Not but Dr. Pandey was still in my heart and in my mind. So my first paper, which I presented under the chairmanship of Professor, uh, Professor, uh, forgetting his name, Professor, anyhow, at the University of Bordwan. Later on, he became the director of a National Atlas and Thematic Mapping Organization, S.P. Chatted. Sorry, very sorry, sorry, very sorry. Professor S.P. Chatted on the industrialization and urbanization of Asansol Durgapur region. This paper was published in the centenary volume of Radwan mm -hmm. University, and it was appreciated very much by Professor S.P. Chatted. So that was how, even he was not present with me at the present, at the present situation, he guided me to become a scholar. And later on, I worked on the problems of urbanization in West Bengal, and it was awarded a degree. Then I left for Anthropological Survey of India, selected from Indian Public Distribution. And this is how I got a little detached oh, from my last university, my life. But whenever Rajiv University called me to be there, I always present. And the last seminar was also organized by the Department of Geography, uh, Rajiv University, Rajiv, where Anthropological Survey of India funded the whole program. It was only meant due to me that I was heading the Anthropological Survey of India as a head of the office. So Professor Pandey's uh, academic contribution, I have not much to say, but whatever he has written, whatever he has promoted in the field of geography, it is being remembered by many of his students of that period of time. Thank you very much, Madam. Thank you very much, Dichandar Shukla ji. Thank you very much, Devendra ji, for giving me this opportunity. I can see Professor Rana Pratap Singh ji. My Namaskar to him, Namaskar to everybody, Professor Gupta, Professor Krishna Kumari, and all of the senior developers who are deeply associated on this platform. Uh, I run a small institution also named Foundation of Practicing Geography, and we used to publish a journal, Practicing Geography. Uh, but fortunately, unfortunately, from 1998, it's not been published. Due to the, the UGC pr problem, though we have 300 life members circulating nearly 560 uh, journals to the life members and different universities and research administration, administrative department, but our journal could not be uh, listed. So that is how. But Foundation of Practicing Geographer is working at Calcutta. We have nearly seven or eight books published by this organization. Shuklaji has been contributing in my journal. So the latest uh, volume which is coming up is Geography and Health, Frontiers Ahead. It is a joint program by Adamus University of Calcutta and Foundation of Practice in Geography. The another uh -huh. book is in the pipeline published from Foundation of Practice in Geography is Decoding Geography. The books which is already on the stand is COVID-19 in geological perspective. So this is how, uh, with my training in the Ranchi University under Professor Pandey and later on Professor N.I. Ahmad, and then again at the Department of Geography, Badwan University, I am living in Calcutta oh, 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 oh. in Navi Mumbai with my son. Thank you very much to all of you. Thank you very much to Jitinderji for
requesting me to say something on Prabhu Thank you. Thank sir. you very much. Thank you. Thank you so much, Professor Arun Singh sir, for sharing your golden memories. Indeed, we ha all have angels in our life in the form of our gurus, and so we could reach to these positions. And we will pray Almighty for getting your journal listed in UGC care list. All the best to you. Thank you, sir. Now, uh, with Chairperson Sir Professor, I would like to invite Sardar Ali Siraji sir from Pakistan to say a few words. Uh, uh, thank you very much for uh, asking me to say a few words. It is always a pleasure to be part of this uh, uh, online series, monthly online series, in which the geographers of India, uh, the, the, uh, the, the old geographers of India, they are being uh, praised and they, their uh, services are being highlighted by their fellow colleagues and their students. Uh, actually, I was not feeling well today. So uh, knife uh, and I have four stitches actually in the morning. So uh, I was in two mind whether to attend or not. But then I thought I got to attend the, <laughs> the, the lecture series and uh, listen what the geographers of India has done so far. And it is all commendable. I'm really happy the way the have developed the subject of in India, not in India, but in the whole world. In Pakistan, we always look uh, towards the Indian world. We have uh, a lot of books which are being written by Indian authors, and those are being taught at our postgraduate level as well. So I'm thankful, uh, thankful to the organizers of the uh, this seminar and uh, I would like to let you know one thing uh, on 14th August this year coming August I'm going to be retired from my services in Pakistan the retirement age is 60 years so I'm attaining uh, on 14th August 2023 so uh, by the time I will attend the next seminar I will be a retired professor among all of you. Thank you very much for asking me to say a few words. Thank you so much, Siraji, sir. In spite of these challenges, you are always wholeheartedly with us. Thanks a lot. Thank you Thank you. Uh, we will now invite uh, Professor Umesh Kumar Mathil, sir, from Nepal to say a few words. Sir, you are muted. Please unmute yourself. Yeah. So I would like to respect all the distinguished, respected, our senior geographers uh, as a president, mm -hmm. Professor H. S. Gupta, as a convener. Professor S. B. Charan Madam and as the chief guest, Professor A. Krishna Kumari and distinguished guest, Professor Kalpana Markande and today's speaker, Professor Jitendu Sukla and our guest of honors, Professor Bindu, Professor Anuradha, Professor Madhusri and Dr. Kavish Kaveri and all the organizing committees. So I would like to salute, first of all, one of the founder makers of geography in India is Professor Pardumn Pandey. So Professor Pardumn Pandey is not only the founder of India and not only the makers of geography in India, but also in the India subcontinent as a Nepal, Bhutan, Pakistan, Sri Lanka. Because all the geography particularly developed, growth, particularly in India, then we have the 
is spread about the neighboring countries. So I would like to salute, salute late Professor Kondumna and his contributions to develop the geography in the uh, SARC regions. So today's speaker is Professor Jitendra Sukla. He very good explained regarding the personality of the Professor Pardumna Pandesar and his contribution to develop the subcontinent. So we have a 40 episode online series on the factors and methods of modern geography in India. And today's event <laughs> the Professor Pardum Pande, <clears throat> all explained by his contribution by the speaker. So we came to know from our seniors, mm. he has made <laughs> many, many contributions in not only the particular branch <laughs> of geography. But the major fundamental geography, like the industrial geography, urban geography, and then we have the rural geography, and many, many research have been contributed by him in the field of geography and ground reality uh, of the India. So this platform is very, very appropriate and are very good for those who are not knowing about the senior geographers regarding this India subcontinent and we came to know their contribution by one of the speaker in each and every episode from the beginning of this 40 episode. So this is the very, very particular complete development of the Saga South Asia Geographers Association. So that we can know each other, other regarding this subject and its development in the subcontinent. So this is an initiative, particularly by the Professor Devendra Prasad Singh. He is a director of the Institute for Environmental Research and Rural Development. So from the beginning till today, he has contributed much to join the geographers in the SAR countries. And this is the first platform and the Pangea to make the connected all the geographers in Pakistan Bangladesh, Sri Lanka, Nepal, and still we have the silence to link the most of the geographers in every country of the Sark regions. And also we try to make the connect the uh, geographer from the uh, I mean, so one of the country is left. Uh, that is the. Uh, I'm forgetting the that name of this country particularly, but we still have to join this. So for this event, I would like to thank very much to the Professor Devendra Prasad Singh and his entire organizing uh, members he, from the beginning today. He has made a lot of contribution to join each other and knowing to each other regarding their contributions, not only present geographers, but also the distinguished geographers, senior geographers, our ancestor of geography to know each about and their contribution. So this is very, very pertinent and then uh, is very good a platform in Pangea of this geography so I can salute all the members, all the distinguished, all the scientists appear in this 40 episode and particularly to the 
SB Simon Mamla, Madam, so from the beginning to this, he has uh, contributed a lot to join all the members. So thank you, ma'am, and invite the members of this uh, 40 uh, episode platform, and particularly to the director of ERD, uh, 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 IERARD, Professor Devendra Kishan. Thank you, members. Thank you. Thank you so much, Professor Ramesh, for your suggestions, comments, and this keeps us motivated and we'll try to give our best on this platform. Please be associated with us also. Thank you so much. Now I would like to invite our most honorable president of the session, Professor H.S. Gupta, sir, <laughs> Professor of the School of Studies in Geography, Pandit Ravi Shankar Shukla University, Raichi, for his presidential remark. Thank you so much, sir, for your auspicious presence. Thank you, Madam Satishmita Ji. Uh, I was thinking that if the media persons uh, someday will listen to you anchoring a program, they will take you away from geography and <laughs> let you <laughs> and ask you to join some uh, channel as its anchor. It's most important anchor. You speak so well and anchor and conduct the meeting so well that it is very very commendable and very impressive. Uh, thank you very much. Now, I have been asked to give my presidential address. It is not a lengthy address, but it will be uh, some um, light on, it will show some light on the uh, 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 present episode. And I want to take this opportunity to speak up about the geography, the, geography, the challenges, the status, and what is the future of our discipline. We have many challenges, and this is the place where we, discuss, we should um, talk to each other that how to meet your challenges. First of all, in fact, uh, this is the day when we had just mourned the death of uh, three eminent geographers. Uh, Dr. Rambali Singh was my friend, and it is a personal loss to me. He was he had been suffering from cancer. Later, he broke his uh, bone, and ah, this, uh, compelled him to uh, become immobile and lead a very, very painful life, which was really a, a shock to the whole family and himself. That was the occasion when his family and he himself started feeling that a life of this sort could not continue for a long. In all the cases I have seen, when the persons reaches this situation, which is unbearable and very painful. He himself and his family start realizing to uh, start realizing that God may free the body from his soul as soon as possible. It was very painful, it was shocking to me. Now I come to the point Today we have heard so many people, people, particularly the speaker, Professor Jitendra Shukla ji, uh, the main speaker of the episode. So he spoke, he and all the speakers he spoke so kindly and so emotionally about Professor Pandey that it made me realize that this is the earning of a teacher, that we are remembered fondly and affectionately even after retirement or even after the death. This type of remembrance 
Is there absent in any other account? They are only money matters, power matters. But this affection, this love, only teachers get if they are good teachers and definitely they are students. Professor Pandey, although I never met him, but I had known him. He was a very courteous person. He, in fact, died at the peak of his career. Had he been alive, even after that, he would have done more work and more made more contributions, very useful for us. But that is the God's will. We can't do anything. I had heard that he had um, perhaps some problem of labor or that, um, but I don't know much about him. Uh, but know that he was very affectionate as Dr. Jitay Sokla and other who have been their student or their colleagues. Uh, are the persons who are present here online. Uh, they spoke so emotionally, so fondly, uh, that it is a matter of very uh, matter of pride that a teacher gets so much of affection, so much of regard, uh, even after his. Professor Jitain Sukla made a very emotional appeal, very emotional, uh, gave a very emotional contribution. He learned almost all the fields, rather many fields. Major of those fields were uh, industrial geography, urban geography, rural geography and so on. In fact, when we look at geography, it is so, such a wide subject. It has such a great expanse that any geographer, whosoever he may be, is not confined to a particular branch of geography. He makes some contribution in more than one branches. This what this is what Dr. Pandey did. Dr. Pandey led a very austere life as I knew about him. Very simple, very cordial, very courteous. I salute him. I pay my regard um, even after his death. I wanted to meet him sometime. Dr. Agrawal of my university used to go to Rachi and he used to talk about him. I thank my, this, uh, our Professor, I thank Professor Devendra Prasad Singh for inviting me to preside in the 40th episode of Founders and Makers of Geography in India, devoted to this noble soul. It is really an honor to me. I have some points to make. Professor Singh has done such a huge work, which is in fact unthinkable for a person in any other discipline, even in any, any scientific discipline, he has undertaken a huge task, a huge project uh, on his own task with respect to time and money both. I feel honored to be a part of this program. This project will be, will prove to be an encyclopedic repository of the contributions of Indian geographers. Credit goes to his associates who, are, who have been working relentlessly to, in this program. I think the work after publication, which he uh, which Professor Singh uh, 
uh, wants to do after publication this this will make a guideline will be a guideline for further research a historical work this is this will prove to be an historical work in which we can assess the progress of geography from um, uh, perhaps uh, it started 1930s uh, uh, since then till now contributions of all old geographers and now new geographers also new entrants will be printed in the form of document and it will be after that a document which will make a uh, landmark in the history of indian geography history of geography will not be complete without consulting this work of professor singh uh, my uh, salute to him uh, my um, congratulations to professor singh who is completing this work professor singh and his his assistants his organizing secretaries two organizing secretaries i hope this is an ongoing project as long as these three are in good health we pray god that they remain in good health so that this goes on forever for as long as possible because no one is there to do such type of huge work now we about our own discipline usually we pat our back to say very high of our subject everyone says this but we must be able to assess our strength and our weaknesses this is not in this is this may be out of context here but i wanted to take this opportunity to say a few words uh, on this topic on the status of geography on the future of geography <clears throat> the friends may i i would like to really sudet the challenges before us uh, and raise some issues number 1 the first issue to my mind pertains to the public perception of our of our discipline that is geography our discipline does not fit in the thematic or physical division of knowledge unlike physics chemistry geology botany economics sociology etc we are in fact spatial systems scientists or analysts what is space space does not mean to geographers antariksh we cannot go there we have our own limitations the space in geography is limited to the earth surface slightly below it slightly above it not more than not less so i as spatial systems analysts are students uh, we study since uh, spatial systems we must delimit our scope we must be limited within our scope so that our contribution is more helpful and more recognized in the society it must be no made socially relevant otherwise our discipline will disappear as far as physical geography is concerned uh, geomorphology climatological climatology and to some extent oceanography fit in the image of public image of geography is public but as regards social so social aspect that is human geography as the in many branches we deviate from our path 
and therefore people start questioning what is geography in it and this i have seen i have experienced what is geography in it so unless we make our study limited to the spatial systems analysis our study we shall not make any contribution which will be important for others for the society we cannot make contribution in all the fields it is not within the scope or within the capacity of any discipline we must delimit ourselves to what is to be done what is not to be done recently i learned that some work is being done on um, corona or covid 19 sometimes i think can we contribute anything with respect to corona geographers are competent to enough competent enough to make um, remarkable contributions or just superficial description uh, we are going to make in this respect so our study should should be in depth study otherwise you should leave that field although our experience is very wide thank you varun but for in depth study we have to take help to take data from relevant fields for such as if we are working on in population geography field we must take take help from some uh, of the thank you we are working in geomorphology we must take help of ge geology if we are working in economic economic geography we must take help of economics like that so this is the um, condition which i wanted to point out um, the next field the next issue is non availability of good students non availability of good students because of career orientation of parents and the students the science subjects is preferred as number 1 to art it is followed by commerce and social science subjects come next that is it comes third in the hierarchy it is because uh, once more even uh, government is not doing very justice in my state chatisgarh four subjects perhaps this is the condition in all the subjects constitute one subject geography economics history and civics constitute one subject that is social science social studies and one teacher is appointed for social studies uh that is is it possible that a teacher coming from non geography background is competent to teach geography not at all basic concepts are therefore not clear uh, among, uh, among the students teacher he he himself does not know many thing even higher even after they reach the college or university level they don't know what is meridian of longitude parallel of latitude these are very basic things that but mm -hmm. so therefore and we are not less to blame to blame in this field even we are not doing many we are not talking about teaching in geography particularly at a school level in my whole career i have never heard any paper or any one to speak about the status of school education with reference to geography only once in 1994 in a conference of iig held at raipur professor pramila kumar of sagar presented a special lecture on school education 
with reference to geography, that was all the matter ended there. So how it can be possible to improve the status of geography? We may talk so much of research, we may talk so much of university education, but unless school education is, is strong, unless our base is strong, the structure cannot be strong. Thirdly, the, the uh, so-called quantitative revolution, the basic uh, country, uh, uh, characteristic of any revolution is to dismantle the pre-existing structure and establish a new one. These uh, quantitative geographers started dismantling two things, regional geography and uh, cartography although they did not succeed. Regional geography was, uh, in fact, they were trying to dismantle, but these two fields, regional geography is the best craft of geography, as we know it. And cartography is the tool par excellence of geographers. If we leave these two fields, what will be the condition of geography? Ultimately, these two fields emerged with the great vigor and great strength. Uh, as regards regional geography, um, uh, many, uh, in fact, regional, the word region was of great contempt of these revolutionaries. Space was replacing this word reason, but no one knew what actually is space. I read a number of papers in 60s on space and place, but it was not understood. It's philosophically in abstract way. An abstraction does not mean anything unless it gives some physical uh, shape. Later on, even Isard wrote that space without delimitation has no meaning. So therefore, regional geography again came in light. Only thing that changed is that formerly regional structures were described in regional geography. Then the process, explanation of process was added. Now two things were here for our study, structure, regional structure, and then social process which make the region. So structure and process both were added to that. As regards cartography, it jumped up in a new shape, in the shape of com computerized cartography, computer cartography, and then GIS. GIS was evolved by a geographer, Roger Tomlinson, a British born Canadian geographer in nine, late 1960s. But it could not be popular for quite some time. But after 70s, when a lot of spatial data from satellites started coming in and the two technologies GIS and remote sensing were combined to that. It became very important and fortunately remote sensing and GIS is being taught in perhaps all the universities and colleges these days at the BA level, BSc level, MA and MSc level. This is a good sign. Therefore, these points must be taken into account and we must consider these points also in our conferences, seminars, in our programs. So that is all I wanted to say. As I said, it may not be uh, the subject of discussion at this platform, this is a platform for some other purposes. The purpose of um, charting the 
contributions of our geographers and uh, making a study on the basis and you changes in changing changes taking place in the field of geography since it's uh, came in existence in india and evaluate it and make ways how to make it more socially relevant and important thank you once again i thank you uh, for listening me so patiently uh, thank you dr samasmita uh, professor singh is not here i wanted to thank him sir is here sir is here sir <laughs> acha where is he he is not <laughs> i thank all the speakers uh, i thank all the speakers that too from not only from india uh, from pakistan from nepal um, sometimes from lanka and uh, bangladesh also representations are made this time it is like making uh, very eminent scholars were present today and delivered very good lectures um, uh, and professor p pandey who was remembered so fondly uh, it goes to the credit uh, of credit of it goes to the credit uh, of professor singh that he arranges such a good program and he has been arranging let us uh, pray god again that this ongoing project is ongoing and he keeps a good health for a very long time thank you thank you thank you so much professor hs gupta sir for chairing the session as a president of the session it's a great blessing for us for having your association here and it's our proud to listen to you on so many different aspects and concern for the subject definitely what you said regarding cancer is very true and uh, professor devendra pratap singh sir has already started working on it to his institute of environmental research and rural development and very soon he'll be having organic farming as well as medicinal farm farms in his vicinity which he had announced in the last sessions uh, regarding the subject as you rightly said special dimensions uh, geography is the only subject which is incorporate incorporating all the disciplines as you rightly said underground over on the surface and above the surface none of the other subject is having this particular type of combination which A geography is having, and geography is the foundation of everything. But unfortunately, it has been not given due care, and uh, for that, I feel uh, we as geographers are <coughs> responsible for it to some extent. But nevertheless, uh, with your suggestions and comments, we will keep working on it. And the present national education policy is really a great uh, thrust. where different disciplines would be combined together as you rightly suggested e economist and geographer geologist and geographer same way the physicist and geographer so when this combination is will be working together then the real study of special aspects and the challenges which are there regarding various issues that people are facing or environment is facing can be studied and geographers would be the best to analyze the data interpret the data find what are the challenges as well as provide solutions with the help of all other specialists in different disciplines and very soon we will have that dream coming true in india and for the whole universe as a well. uh, regarding uh, your comment regarding con convener of the sessions it's a definitely a gift uh, and a blessing from devendra pratap singh sir to me and uh, i thank him for showing this faith uh, thank everybody on this platform for acknowledging motivating and appreciating but at the same time i would also like to say that uh, geography is my root and uh, definitely it won't take me away from the subject of geography but this is an added uh, 
I'll say portfolio to my CV. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you once again for your precious comments and valuable remarks as presidential president of the occasion. Uh, now I would like to invite Professor Devendra Singh, sir, director of researches, to say a few words if he has anything to announce. Thank you, madam, very much. And once again, good evening to all the geographers from various corners of the country, and not only from the India, from also outside India. And I, I have to announce two, three uh, our future programs. Number one, our 41st episode will be organized on the 13th of August this year. One day before the retirement of our great friend, Professor Sabdarari Siraji. On the thir uh, uh, 13th of August, just a day before retirement, we are going to organize our 41st uh, episode. And uh, that will be the, your last episode uh, as an active geographer. And even up after then, we, shall, we are not going to spare you because you are the person behind the concept of South Asia Geographer Association. So after your retirement, uh, we will utilize your full time energy and talent for organizing the South Asia Geographer Association. The first conference of SAGA is proposed to be organized in Madhur City, Bodh Gaya, the inter international center of tourism. And it will be per perhaps it will be organized in the month of February, the preparation preparations are going on, bar footings. And our 41st episode will be devoted to one very, very popular professor of geography of uh, Punjab University Chandigarh, Professor R.C. Chandana. And our respected Madam Professor Asmita Bhutani will be delivering the main lecture. So you, you all are invited and requested to participate in our the coming 41st episode that will be organized on the 40, uh, 30th of August this year. A second, we are going to release our uh, five volumes, first five volumes. We are trying to release it in October or November. And last week I was in Delhi and I contacted uh, the uh, Center of uh, Regional Studies in Department uh, in GNU. And they are uh, very much agreed and pleased to organize our the release function uh, of uh, our five volumes, first five volumes on founder and makers of modern geography in India. JNU people are ready, ready to organize our release function. And perhaps we will, we will be able to organize it in the month of October or in the month of November this year. And third is, we are going to organize the first Saga conference in the, uh, perhaps in the month of February next year. And we are also going to release a book on a status of geography in South Asia. And we have requested our friends from our uh, neighboring country to contribute a chapter on the state, uh, status of geography of their concerned country. And Professor uh, Sardar Ali Siraji is doing it for Pakistan. Our friend Umesh Kumar Mandal is also doing it for Nepal and our Bangladesh friends, Sri Lankan friends are all also doing for uh, uh, chapters of their concerned countries. Uh, for information of our friend Umesh Kumar Mandal, I am happy to inform that um, Bhutan, Bhutan people are also with us and they have also joined us and they, they are also profiting uh, our move. 
So these are, these are uh, and I have also requested Professor uh, Anuradha Sarmaji of Jammu University to have a lecture on the founders of Jorafin Jammu University and she had agreed for the same. So these are some announcements and uh, uh, once again I am thankful to you all and uh, once again very good evening to all of you. Thank you very much. Thank you so much sir. Indeed you are putting very great efforts and we all will work for its success with blessings from Almighty. Thank you sir. Thank you so much. Now I would like to invite and request Mr. Shalini Kulkarpeta, Madam, Associate Professor, Department of Geography, Ranchi Women's College from Zarkand, to propose a vote of thanks. Organizing faculty, senior professors, my colleagues, and junior participants, and all geographers. A very good evening to you all. At the outset, let me first express my gratitude to President, Convener, Intercessor, Organizing Secretary for providing me this opportunity to deliver a word of thanks to an August gathering of 40th lecture series of the founders and makers of modern geography in India, dated 30th July 2023. Mm -hmm. I feel special thanks to President of this series, Professor H. S. Gupta, Professor and Head, School of Studies in Geography, Pandit Ravi Shankar Shukla University, Raipur, Convener, Professor S. V. Chauhan, Professor and Head, Department of Geography, University of Mumbai, Maharashtra, and ex-president of Bombay Geographical Association, chief guest, Professor A. Krishna Kumari, professor and head, Department of Geography, Registrar, Krishna Dev Rai University, Anand Kuramu, Andhra Pradesh, distinguished guest, Professor Kalpana Markande, former professor and head, and Geoinformatics, Usmania University, Hyderabad, Guest of Honor, Professor Bindu Bhatt, Professor and Head, Department of Geography, the MS University of Baroda, Vadodara, Gujarat, Professor Anuradha Sharma, Professor and Head, Department of University of Jammu, Jammu and Kashmir, Professor Madhushri, Professor, Department of Geography, former Dean, Faculty of Science, Gohati <coughs> University, Assam, Dr. Kaveri, Dabadkar, Assistant Professor, Department of Geography, Government, Vilasa Girls, PG Autonomous College, Vilaspur, Chhattisgarh, Intercessor, Dr. Devendra Prasad Singh, former Vice President of NAGU, Organizing Secretaries, Dr. Ambris Kumar Rai, Assistant Professor, PG Department of Geography, Veer Kumar Singh, University Ara, Bihar, and Dr. Ambi Kumar, Assistant Professor, Head, PG Department of Geography, Munger University, Munger, Bihar. Speaker, Professor Jitendra Sukla, former pro Professor and Head, Department of Geography, Dean, Social Science, Nilambar Pitambar University, Dalton Gun, Jharkhand. Professor Dr. Siraj from Pakistan, Dr. Harsimrit Kaur, Assistant Professor, Ranchi Women's College, Ranchi. I thank you all of your presence in this lecture series and sharing your acknowledgement, thoughts, experience, experiences, contributions, and new techniques. From historical presence, this kind of lecture series have immense value as we get acquainted with many price-based contributions of eminent figures who were working anonymously, anonymously. In this lecture series, we come across the many thoughts and the ideas, valuable contributions and the suggestions based on the personal and group experiences. Modern and latest techniques 
and tools which are of immense use not only in the current time but also in the future to come their experience enhanced our knowledge too it is only possible to share this experience in one platform here for the development of work of association of south asian geographers i thank dr jitendra shukla who has delivered his lecture about dr p pandit sir he reflect his personality that is noble behavior and helping attitude to all teachers colleagues and students too dr pandey was a man of deep knowledge high degree of intellectual sense and discipline as he was known as the perfect man dr shukla sir has taken very key observation of achievements and contributions of respected dr p pandey sir he has clearly let us know about pandey sir's childhood at village and higher studies in abroad this knows is high degree of intelligence shukla sir has explained about his 16 research papers published especially based on urban geography that is urbanization in bihar urban hierarchy regional distribution pattern history of urbanization in chota nagpur industrial landscape and urban field in ranchi etc he had written many books and articles in geographical outlook too many phd scholars under his guidance finally holded the post of hod university department of geography ranchi university this events were pride for the geographers of ranchi lastly i would like to thank i would like to say that dr pandey sir was an eminent geographer of the country and having global recognition on behalf of all this who witnessed this grand event i acknowledge and appreciate the hard work behind to make this event meaningful and outstanding learning experience the precious time spared by all of immense appreciated thank you all thanks thank you so much professor shalini madam for your most warm vote of thanks to all the respected geographers on this platform participants um we definitely have many more geographers here who would like to share about uh, professor pandey and so i would like to request them to pen down those uh, memories with pandey sir they had and please send it to devendra pratap singh sir so that it can get incorporated in the publications and the other sides of the of professor pandey not only as your teacher but also as your mentor will get reflected for others to go through uh, thank you so much for being here now i request dr kaviri madam to please say, to say our national anthem I request everyone to please stand. Thank you, Dr. Sarvashita Madam. Jai 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 Jai